Hi there and welcome back to Baldur's Gate. I'm Baron. It appears my cold is back with a vengeance, so let's see whether I can record a few more videos before, before things get worse. So we're still in the city of Baldur's Gate, um, I guess in the western district or something like that. So we are still exploring the city of Baldur's Gate as we've been doing for 10, 12 videos now. And for almost as long we've been poisoned. But we should get to the bottom of things now. Talking about the bottom of things, we are at the bottom of the map here though. We should be able to get to the bottom of things what now. Would you have me do? Or I'll just reload and you'll never see the video. What's that? A door. And a barrel. Did I check insist. that barrel in the last video? Apparently not. Huh, you're a queer I guess that door's locked. I'm gone. Exactly. So let's get in here. Your wish? All right, all right. No, not closing. Entering would be awesome. Who are you? Fenton. I need a swig of some strong dwarven ale. Just back from an ankhag frenzy across the river and a bit south. They're in one of their boom cycles, I guess. With iron all shot to hell, there's a good market for ankhag armor these days. Bring me back a good batch of scales and I'll pay you richly for them. Just go down there and talk to Gertie. She'll fill, e fill you in on what to do. Yeah, we already did that <coughs> in an earlier Hurry video. Up! Maybe like 50 videos away or something. We already killed a lot of lots of pancakes. Let's see whether we can charm you. No, wait, I wanted to charm you. Of course, we saved. Saved was his breath. Of course, we could go down and kill a few pancakes. Oh, it worked. Oh, nice. What you want? But I've we don't really have to. <coughs> it's locked. Yay, money. What's that? Just a regular longsword? Exactly. Anything else here? No. What would you have me do if you insist? So we move up. Yep, this way. Appears to be empty. <coughs> ah, dang, it's getting worse. <laughs> Again, they look empty chests. What's that? A bloodstone ring. I wish. think you can keep it. Very well. And done. Or not? I said done. And actually I meant it. If you insist. Awesome. Hurry up! Great. So I say we head to the north. Oh no, don't tell me there's another wall in the way. There's another wall in the way. Great. Just what the doctor had ordered. <coughs> another wall. Awesome. Uh, can we get to the other side of that building here? Get down a bit. No, apparently not. So that's it. That's That's all we can do down here. That's not really much. I think we should leave. So we should probably go to that district from the north. And there was another wall up here, okay. But as you can see, there is actually no way for us to, you know, approach that part of the city from the north because, well, there's nothing here, this is the edge of the map. But I guess we are down here, and if we would walk to the south what from would you now, have me do? from that all spot right, here, right. we would probably, you know, enter the district on the other side of the wall. Awesome. Uh, let's continue on then. All right, all right. You know the thing with the walls in the districts. Yeah, you shouldn't have done that. This is just plainly annoying. You know, it's not really going to stop me, but it's please, just... Might I have your ear a moment? What? Varys Roaring Horn. 
Pooh, please, might I have your ear a moment? Well, if I can get it back, you might. My name is Varsity, and I have heard you sometimes help those in need for a fee, of course. Please, would you meet with my guardian at this house? My guardian will reveal the nature of the job once we arrive. Please, it's a matter of death and life. Okay, lead on, young one. I will follow. Oh, excellent. I may yet repair the damage I have caused. This way, I'll show you to the house where my master is staying. Well, <coughs> do that. It's probably just the next door, right? Oh, okay. Well, let's hope it's not locked. No, it's not locked. Get in. There is nothing I can do. But I must do something. It is a risk. And risk is everything. Tremaine Belladar. Varsi, who have you brought here? I told you I must be alone with my thoughts. Your thoughts know as I do, and there be no denying it. We need outside help to fix what's done, and talk among the LA said that this group may as be may be as effective as any we could hope for. <clears throat> You'll tell me later how you know and what allies to learn such things for now however you are correct we are in <coughs> sorry in need of assistance and none of the clergy must know greetings to you all i am lord priest tremaine belladar beldiar whatever a humble servant of our smiling lady timora oh lady timora isn't that where i should bring the skull my request of you is an odd and very dangerous one i will not hold you to it if you deem it too extreme. I would have you enter the Water Queen's house and retrieve my son's body. He and Varsi sought to indulge their restless nature by sneaking about the place and a high pre price was paid. We thought it would be exciting, causing a little mischief amidst Umberly's underlings, only it wasn't that much fun when we were caught. We both ran, I got away, Cassant didn't. They, they killed him as we sought to escape. That's rather harsh. Uh, yeah, a harsh sentence for a simple prank, but trespassing on holy ground with ever the faith is no small crime. You must bring his body to me that I must, might restore his life to him, if you can retrieve him. I will reward you whether I am able to revive him or not. What say you? Uh, luck or no, it would be a shame to lose your life because of the foolishness of youth. I'll help as best as I can. There is hope for my son yet. I cannot tell you where in the Umberland Temple Chasm would be kept, but I would advise you to be careful. They seem a right unfriendly group. Please, once you get to know them, they seem... Uh, but once you get to know them, they seem out and out heartless. Please hurry. Okay. Yeah, but since we helped that girl, maybe they will give us um, the body back. <coughs> no, we shall see. Let's go to the exit again. Well, we already found the Temple of the Umpaline. The Bitch Queen. I really like that. It's a nice title for a goddess. <coughs> oh man, I hate the cold. Okay, moving on. Um, I think it was down here. Yeah, it was. Entrance was here, if I'm not totally wrong. Yes, and I said, man. But, uh, you know, occasionally. Okay, moving on. Okay, Haywood already arrived, but he has boots of speed, so he's always faster than the rest. Oh, they are close. <coughs> oh, I hope I can carry the dead body. Oh, but then again, uh, he is very strong now, maybe he can do it. Uh, wait a sec, where is Imoen? 
Emma and your stupid little... Uh, which way were you taking? Pull yourself together, girl. We don't have all day. Um. Okay. Pause. Um. Hurry up, if you insist. Priestess. The bitch queen. Brooks no insolence. I wish nothing of you, save the body of the fool that tried to break into your hallowed halls. I imagine the return of such an infidel is ample return for my services. Try a thousand gold? That's highway robbery. Wait a second, this can't be it. Stop it, who are you? Priestess of Umberley, Priestess of Umberley. You're not a priestess I'm looking for. Where's the girl that we rescued? <coughs> Don't tell me she's not here. I think I saw her in the last video. Or, you know, when I last checked the temple. Whenever that may have been. She's not here. I really hate how those guys are blocking the way. The way is free now. Move it. Wait, there's nobody here. That's that's bad. Maybe I have to pay the two thousand. Priestess of Umberley. The bitch queen brooks no insolence. Oh, skip it then. We paid the two thousand. The bitch queen. Brooks, no insolence. All right, we're willing to pay the cash. Just give us the body. We oui. can I still move? I can move. Child's body. This is the body of a child. What would you have? Me Good do? thing we have a lot of money. <clears throat> Let's go to the exit here. All right, all right. <coughs> And I guess we have to approach from the north again. We want to get things done. All right, all right. Alrighty. So here if was the door. <coughs> Let's see how things develop now. Um, hi. You roll your dice, and you take your chances. By all the gods, the lady who smiles must be positively beaming this day. Quickly, get the body inside, where I pretty tomorrow will grant that life in you. I'll not waste another moment until my son's soul is on solid ground once more. Come with and see the wonder. Fine, we follow you. Where's the wonder? Your wish? You roll your dice and you take your chances. Now, the moment I have yearned for. Please, all no noise. I must concentrate. <coughs> oh. What? Resurrected. Bless be our smiling lady. He lives. Son, can you hear me? Father, I. What's going on? Oh my dear, dear boy, you are in such trouble. What in all the planes were you thinking, child? Gully venting through an umberly temple like that? So help me, if turning you over my knee wouldn't kill you outright, I jump black. <laughs> I jump black to go right to blue. I no, you'd jump black to go right 
to blue. Okay, so I probably is referring to like you know beating someone black and blue. But but it wasn't my fault. Oh no, you don't. If you want to play the odds, you had best be sure you take responsibility for yourself. The goddess of luck and adventure does not endorse dumb luck or foolish risks. I swear, if your mother were alive to hear about this, she'd drop dead where she stood, and then I'd have to raise her too. <laughs> Do you have any idea what the spell takes out of a person? But I... we... I'm so... Not another word past your lips, young man. You're off to your room and see if I let you out before you're four score and twenty. March. But I... Oh. Okay. Please help. There's a wasted life at stake. I have your payment here. It will be some time before Cass and I get a night out again. It's good to have him back among the living, though I take small, small pleasure in the trouble he's in for what he did. You'll notice I have not sat down since you've known me. Sometimes our lady who smiles downright laughs out loud. Look to us if you need any aid in the future. Many a tomorrow will look favorably on you now. Good day. Oh, we got 5,000 XP and 2,000 gold back. That's good. Let's see what's in that chest. Hurry up! Chomped. I care not. I've done had enough of this. But apparently that's not the, the temple of the lady. That's just the house. Blue stone necklace. Yeah. Yum, yum, yum. History of the darkness. History of the light. No, history of the unicorn run. Ah, that's what we needed, but we already found a volume of that and gave it to the girl who wanted it. So we died at the quest item. Well. But we found it, uh, you know, at the if tower of the mage. History of the heartlands. History of the centurion. Oh hi, you're sleeping. That means I have to charm you if I want to take a look at that. Your wish? So, good thing is that my nymph cloak works as well as the cloak that I lost. Charmed, yay. Mm. Uh, yeah, it worked, okay. <laughs> you're a queer fellow. Oh, it's not even this locked. Way. <coughs> Money and uh, history of the Uthgard. Hurry up! If you insist. What would you have me do? Alright, alright. Fine. If you insist. What's that? Oh, there's a barrel. Oh, don't tell me there's another wall in the way. Oh, dang it. What's that here? The lady's house. Oh, very nice. This is where I want to go. How where's the entrance here? Chantalas Albright. Agnesia. I think we should talk about to her about the skull. Hey, we found when did we find that shield? Large shield plus one plus four versus missiles. Nobody needs that. Uh, we have be no nobody actually needs shields uh, because everybody uses bows and stuff. Well, she has a shield. What kind of shield does she have? Art shield plus two. Yeah. Okay. It's a better one. So yeah. Well, if we want, we I think we have to talk to her about that skull here, skull of Kareth. If we want to heal that guy. Can I assist all right. you? Yes, you can assist me. The skull of Kareth. He was a priest here long ago, and Timora blessed him greatly, too greatly, perhaps. Made some people jealous, made him some enemies. Then one night we found him dead, his body torn and broken, his head gone. No one ever found a killer, no one ever asked. It is best to leave that sort of justice to Timora. Perhaps this is her forgiveness, no? Go well in the luck of Timora, stranger. Find Gorak, for he should now be cured of his affliction. 
Oh, really? I don't like the way this group is turning out. Oh, quit bitching. Better you get 1000 XP help. and a reputation plus one. Yes, friend? May the luck of the lady be with you. Wait, that's it? Forgive me, but don't we need something from you? Chantelus Albright, welcome. Luck has seen fit to drop you in the lap of the lady. And she shall take good care of you indeed. Those who dare are always seen in the best light. And we require but a small donation of coin for whatever you need. We are in desperate need of a book known as the Book of Wisdom. Please, we'll do anything if you'd only give it to us. The Book of Wisdom is a very holy book. Why should I give it to the likes of you? Hmm, you must trust us. We'll die if we don't get this book. Please, you don't want your, our death on your conscience, do you? Your pleas seem genuine. Uh, if your very lives depend upon having this book, then here you may have it. E that easy? Did you? Home of Understanding. It raises <coughs> the wisdom. One point. It would be awesome, but I think we need that for... Ah, dang it. I could really use that. Well, I already have a wisdom of 19, but you know, you can never be too wise. Hmm. Forgive me, but <coughs> I have meditations to attend to. What does he have? <coughs> Alex of health. Oh, not too much, actually. Yeah, hmm, well. I Your would Ryan love would to use that book for actions. myself, Your but... Wish? Since we need that to cure our poison... Um, maybe we can't use it for ourselves. Get out! Stupid party! What's the matter with you? So, hmm. Very well. Okay, I think we should go to um, the temple of the bitch queen again. Because she wanted a toe. money. Yes, I do. What? Hurry up! Uh, can I help you? Done. Hello there, Dan X Merchant at your service. How may I be of assistance? Uh, who, 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 so it's the fatty here? How exactly does one become an X Merchant? Well, you start by becoming a merchant. Then you become a gambler. Then you bet your business on a game of dice. Then you lose. Voila, an X Merchant. Next question. <laughs> Could you tell me where the good stores are in town? There are no good stores, good shops in this city. Nope, none. Don't even think about it. Especially the ones run by the Seven Sons or the Merchants Consortium. What's wrong with the Seven Sons and the Merchants Consortium? I used to gamble with these fellows, but something's not right. I'm in debt to them, up to my ears, but nothing's happening. No big guys with clubs knocking on my door in the middle of the night. No poison in my ale, nothing. It's like they've forgotten the whole thing. I saw my old buddy, Al, in the street the other day. Looked him right in the eye and didn't even cuff me about the ears. Just started looking real nervous like he had forgotten his best friend's name at the party or something. Strange, I tell you. Interesting. I met Dunn, the ex-merchant in the city streets today. He has the most interesting suspicions about the Seven Sons and the Merchants Consortium. Two mercantile groups here on Baldur's Gate. He is apparently quite in their debt financially, but for some unknown reason they have stopped pressuring him for payment. And yet they almost, uh, seem almost frightened whenever he approaches them and tries to catch the eye. As of yet I cannot fathom the relevance of this to my investigation. Still this whole affair has been motivated by greed, business and money from the start. If merchants group in the largest city in the region are acting suspicious, I had best take note. Yeah, well. What would you have me do? So yeah, tome of understanding would be a waste. But then again, you dying wish? is no fun either. So <laughs> get <well>. out. <coughs> Back to the harbor. Uh, before we do that, be. we go to that guy who was, you know, the the dead guy, not the dead guy, the guy with, you know, the, the sick guy. Where was he? Don't really know. It was a door here somewhere. Maybe this if one. You insist. The cursed, cursed guy, uh, uh, or deceased, or something was not right with him. 
He wanted us to find the skull of his brother and talk to the girl in the temple. We did all that and she meant she he should be better now. So let's take a look-see. I wish all of them had boots of speed. Would be fun. Okay, in we go. Wrong. All right, all right. Maybe this one. All right, all right. <coughs> you will never know. Very well. Maybe not. Next. If you insist. Was it this one? Yeah, that's him. Stop moving. I have nothing to value. I, I'm cured after all these long years of rotting away an end has come blessed be tomorrow and may my brother at last have peace you are kinder than you'll ever know oh hi I have nothing to value. Please, let we don't even get XP for that or anything I guess not that's rather weird that, uh, that's really weird I have nothing to value. Please, let me be. Okay. I guess a good deed carries its wealth in its own, as you say. So now we... If you insist. Or its reward in its own. Hmm. So I already have 171,000 XP. Just in case you're wondering why I have more than 161,000, that's easy. Because I decided to remove the experience cap, or rather than removing, I uh, set it to minus one. And you will never reach an experience of minus one, and therefore you will never reach the experience cap. Yeah, I think it's only fair. I mean, the party is doing all the work in this game, though so they should get the XP that comes with it. <coughs> Although I'm not really sure whether we will be able to get another level. But yeah. Doesn't matter. Shahira will surely get another level. I guess, yeah. At least another druid level. Where's the rest of my party? Oh, damn. But I could have gotten something out of that. Come on, I killed you. I didn't get anything. Oh. Okay. <coughs> Let's get in here. <coughs> um, hello? What's wrong with you? Thanks. Stop it. Who are you? Yalanta Mistmir. The bitch queen brooks no insolence. So you've returned with the book of wisdom. Let me see it. Um, we don't trust you. Before we show it, we we want the cure to our friend's GS. You dare question my honor? Very well. This scroll is scripted with the incantation that will rid your friend of his curse. Now give over the book. Hmm. Now that's a tough decision. Do we give her the book or don't we give her the book? Actually, we do not have the book. Aren't you the fool? You will pay for such impudence! Impudence? Oh, really? Will I? Hurry up! What if you think? You have need of me? Yes. Everybody has ranged weapons on. Is that right? That's bloody right. That didn't seem to work. Hurry up! We're quite strong actually. Your life ends here. Wait, how much XP did we get for that girl? 
Six thousand. Yeah, that's that's rather nice, I must say. What did you drop, all by right, the way? All right. Two thousand two hundred gold. What would you have Not me do? Bad. Oh, I killed that one Give first. Give us victory! That's easy. Okay. Oh, they die easily. But I think those priestesses uh, only have quantum staffs on them. Oh no, somehow too many. Yeah, you win one, you lose one. I guess that's the way it works. We helped one priestess of the Amberly and we killed the others. I'm sorry. What's that here? Level armor plus one, nobody really needs that, but then again. Quiet. Yes. Wisdom plus one, yay! That's not half bad. And the important thing I guess is the GS removal scroll. Awesome. And I think we have to go to the blade and thingy. Um Blade and Stars, is that correctly in I guess. Hurry up! Alright, alright! Come on, move away from the door. You can't get out if you block the door. <clears throat> Very well. So now I have a wisdom of 20. That would be awesome if I were a priest. I would get lots of bonus spells. <coughs> I can't have everything, I guess. Okay, I think it was the blades and stars thingy. Um, that would be here somewhere, I guess. Oh, wait. What's that? General store? Okay. Ah, I didn't even explore that district yet. No, it's actually in the wrong district, I guess. What would you have me do? I think I already found the blade and stars. Very well. Um, in so it must have been another district. What's that here? Blade and stars. Okay, much better. If you insist. Get it. Where is that guy? Maybe upstairs? All right, all right. Yeah, no thunder. Hi. Guess what we all right, have? All right. My life is in shambles. No. Oh, fuck My off. life is in shambles. Why don't you talk to me? <clears throat> Alright, no, alright! My life is in shambles. False talk. No, my life is in shambles. Alright, no, alright! My life is in shambles. I guess I have to use it on you. Wrong item type. You gotta be kidding me, what's up? What would up? you have me do? Life is oh, in so, how did you fare? Do you have the cure for my GS? To my GS? We have your cure. Now, where's the antidote to the poison? Alright, then, here's my half of the poison. Marek, my partner, possesses the other half of the antidote. You'll find them at the Blushing Mermaid Inn. I can't help you other than that. So, what did we get? Just a regular antidote. And we have Marek's potion of antidote. Lord Thunder has given us half of the antidote. He told us that the other half is possessed by Merrick, who stays at the Blushing Mermaid. <coughs> okay. 
So I guess we go to the Blushing Mermaid then. But maybe he's not there because we already killed him, but we will find that out, I guess. If you insist. <coughs> so I guess the... Um, uh, yeah, we probably have to come from the north again. All right, all right. This is one of those divided districts. I think the Blushing Mermaid was somewhere around here. If I'm not mistaken. Exactly. If you insist. So, where is he? Come on, uh, come on, uh, uh, wait, serving wrench? Yep. Come on, uh. Your wish, very well. Come on, uh. What's in here, though? Nothing. Get away. Is there anybody in here? No. Okay, maybe we have to go upstairs. Oh wait, what's 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 down here? Walk. Hey friend! Good to meet a fine sad such as yourself. Nah, go away. Oh, there are the stairs. Okay. Hurry up! Well hidden. Well hidden. <coughs> Come on, uh, gamesman, gamesman. What would you have there? Well. You're a lucky fella, aren't you? Okay, maybe the game realized that we already killed Merrick. What do we do now? You're a lucky fella, aren't you? So we have two antidotes now. Let's drink them. And let's drink this one. Did it work? Screw things up. You're a lucky fella, aren't you? Yes. Why well, but getting prickly on my eyes? I don't find him. Where is he? If you insist. Everybody have to use this.
<laughs> hey, friend. Good to meet a fine hmm. sod such as yourself. We rest. Hey, friend. Good to meet a fine sod such as yourself. Rest. Hey, friend. Good to meet a fine sod such as yourself. Hey, friend. Good to meet a fine sod such as yourself. I don't hey, know. Hey, friend. Did it work? Good oh, to meet a poison. fine sod such as yourself. Hey, friend. Good to meet a fine sod such as yourself. I guess it worked. This is the 125th day. No, you feel very ill. Didn't work. Where is that guy? <clears throat> Hurry up, if you insist. The game doesn't think I beat the quest yet. That's weird. Um, I will see whether I can solve that. So I guess we're pretty much screwed. I fucked up the game. By killing Marek uh, before the game actually assumes that he poisoned me, I fucked up the quest and therefore fucked up the game. Because um, now the game already knows that Marek is dead and he's taken out of the equation, but the quest still requires me to, you know, talk to him and eventually battle him to get the antidote which is no longer possible since I already did that in the past yes so the game pretty much is broken now and I could redo it like the 15 or 16 videos that I have recorded you know since I killed Marek or I could use a program like the sword curse keeper to edit the game and make the game forget that I killed him and I decided to go for the later option so I brought Marek back in the game he should be upstairs. All right, all right. So let's take a look see. If you insist. And there he actually is, Eric. Yeah, that's one thing with RPGs, you can really fuck them up if you kill a person too soon. Or you know, approach a quest from the wrong side. Stupid saps. They'll never know what hit them. So you have come, I assume, to take the antidote. All you are going to accomplish is to hasten your death. But I think that isn't the foremost worry you have at the moment. And what happens? All of a sudden we are cured of Merrick's poison. We don't actually have to drink the antidote. Just getting to that step of the quest cures you of the poison. And 10,000 experience is nothing to sneeze at. Yeah. But, you know, if Marek is already dead, you can never actually get to that, you know, step in the quest, so you're screwed. Okay, now I guess he tries to cast a spell. <coughs> I don't like that too much. So what we you have me start do? hitting him. Your wish? Boom. He's dead. 650 XP. And I guess we can get his you know, 
equipment for a second time. Another eagle bow. Another dagger plus two. What's that? I'm going to sell it. We only you're only supposed to have it once. <coughs> yeah, and now we're long, no longer poisoned. We don't actually have to drink the antidote, and you can't stack it because the game only thinks you should only have one of those potions. Hmm. Okay. You carry the potions, right? What's that? A potion of master theory that goes to Immoel. And that's a regular antidote, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, it is. Okay, it doesn't show on the map though, uh, on the quest log, uh, that we solved the quest, but I guess that here is all the proof we need. You're cured of Marek's poison. Okay, so this has been quite a long video, and I will take a break now, Hurry and up, I think now I will start uploading fella, those videos. Yeah. Because, yeah, I think we managed. What would you have You're to do? a lucky fella. Or maybe we should return. Uh, where were we? Before we save, we should return to the district we were exploring. All right, I all think right. it was the western one. <clears throat> yeah, that's a long quest. So be careful who you kill, <laughs> you know, on first sight. This can really screw things up. Very well. Yep, here we are again. Okay. All right, all right. Now come on, make your move. So we save. See, this is the test save I made, and here I edited it with the uh, Salt Coast Keeper. And you know, I just set the flag, uh, Marek is dead from 1 to 0, so he was brought back. Yeah, it was the 115th video actually. So, thank you very much for watching, and see you soon. Bye.